Now, I ain't one to gossip, but I will bring you the tea. Welcome to Chronicle Speak. Hear ye, hear ye. The battle of the courtrooms has commenced. And your girl T.S. Madison and your girl Kaya went toe-to-toe last night for the coveted seat on the throne. Kaya presented her show, which is Gag Order. She still has her roasting gags as usual. And T.S. Madison presented her show, The Queen's Supreme Court, alongside Little Mo and Shekinah. Now, don't get me wrong. I absolutely miss these ladies together because the dynamic that they had together was unparalleled. Now, the fact that both of them come on the same night, just two hours apart from each other, we're going to get the same information. They're both going on the Internet. They're both searching for the same thing. The only thing I don't like about T.S. Madison's show, you can really tell that her and the ladies don't have that connection. Back in the day, Kaya and T.S. Madison would kind of talk over the docket the week before and go over everything they wanted to talk about. Lil Mo ain't even watching the shows that they talking about, child. She lost on songs and everything else. That girl was just there to look pretty. Yeah, he did it one you time. You see my Miami? I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. And then, so, so can you hear it? Can you hear it? Yeah, can you hear a note? I don't remember the note she had. Nothing, don't remember. There's something on my mind. What you say? So after four weeks of anticipation, the show failed to give what people were actually looking for, and the internet spoke their piece about it. So I go mosey over to Kaya's page to see what she had to say about it, and I was like, oh my god, am I blocked? Nope, word on the curb is that they made Kaya say bye-bye-bye to her page, honey, and it got deleted. They had threatened her the whole night about how they were going to do it. And Kaya said this. Personally, all in my goddamn motherfucking page, reporting my shit. You can't shut my page down because I don't follow nobody. I don't act nobody. I block everybody. I don't tag nobody, bitch. So all the lies about the bullying and me harassing, my shit ain't going to get shut down because I follow zero. And I will never at you. I give a fuck about you. Okay? Now, although she said what she said, her page was still deleted. Now, I don't necessarily know how it got deleted or what happened. I do, however, know that a caller called into T.S. Madison's show to let her know that Kaya was on the line talking about her. That's not the route we're taking here at the Queen's Supreme Court. Uh, she can have that route. Bless her heart. We wish her well in and her endeavors. Try the next thing I know, Maddie got on that phone and started clicking, and then poof, Kaya's page was gone. They said Maddie Mob is crazy, honey. They don't play when it comes to Madison. So at this point, I'm going to leave it to you guys to tell me what you think about this entire crazy situation. What do you think about both shows now that they're not together? And also, what do you think about Kaya's page getting deleted? Leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe. Let's talk about it down below. And who do you think might have been a better host than Little Mo? I don't know. I'm kind of feeling just hilarious. <laughs> you guys let me know what you think and let's talk about it down below. Talk to you guys later. Bye.